Alright, there's 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. I'm tapped, dude. I'm Tap City. I mean, right, so this is. How much one to give me more? <laughs> that should be it right there. This is TC paying for Caesar's bike that was brought in by D Best. <laughs> nice. D Best uh, Auto Transport. Transport. We've used them for many a transaction. Pili Express. That's good. Okay. It's going to go on our website. Pili Here Express. we go. Thank you very um, much. So we're going to go check out the bike. Go, this go is bike. Up. Is that bike. Go bike. Bike. Cool. No, we're going to get the bike. <laughs> yeah, we're going to see the bike. Yeah. This is uh, the bike that Caesar, our friend from Mexico City, bought from the auction in. Uh, San Antonio or somewhere in Texas, but this is the uh, another bike that's going to be on the San Diego to Pueblo trip, right here on the flatbed, right in the middle. I'm kind of expecting this. It's got some damage on the front, if I'm not mistaken. You can see it in there, nestled between this sexy gold wing. There's a cute little white Vespa. This is a 2015 Super, so it's an ABS model. And again, Caesar's our friend, that's a photographer in Mexico City. Told him about the trip several months ago. And he's been trying to figure out a way to come along with us. So you can kind of see there's actually some front end damage. we will be fixing and kind of getting dialed in so we'll be able to make the trip. All right, and today is Tuesday, April 14th. Again, Vespa Motorsport, San Diego. We're getting pretty close to having all these bikes ready. What's up, TC? How's that sandwich? It's a good sandwich. I want to do a plug for Mona Lisa, a little <laughs> grab and goes. These are the best little sandwiches in town. Dollar, dollar fifty. They pre-make them, stack them up like a pyramid, and they usually sell out by That is a non-paid-for political endorsement for these sandwiches. Go get them now! I got that on the way back from the passport office. Of course, wait until the last minute. That's how you like it. All right. picked up from an auction house, you know, an insurance company totaled it out. It's a 2015 model. Um, fortunately, all the 2015s we've sold here in San Diego haven't been totaled yet. Uh, typically, we would repair them. Some dealer didn't want to do that. Uh, looks like it's going to need a horn cover, some body work, fairly extensive body work on the, uh, the front leg shield, complete new fender. See the, it had a front rack on it, kind of busted off all the mounts right there. Just kind of a little bit beat up in the leg shield frame and floorboard. And kind of typical of an auction bike, it's pretty dirty. They're kind of left out for a while before they go up on the, the auction block. Whoever had it before or whatever the dealer dealer dealt with it, the they, exactly. they took the light bulbs out, they took the seat, they took the knee pad. Did it come in? Does it start, robot? It actually does start. It looks like everything works. And it's got 3,000 miles, 5,000 kilometers on it. it looks so like everything works. ABS all digital. Looks all good in there. They took the tool, tool kit. So, you know, I guess we're going to kind of pressure wash the thing and do a little more assessment on it. 
reach out to see what he wants to do. Uh, but again, this plan is to take this pipe on the chair from San Diego to Puebla. Anything else, Robot? Uh, they took the little caps, the little <laughs> rubber plugs, some pretty petty little things that they can run. Pretty funny. Some deal, some deal in Texas, probably. Alright, so that's it. Sign off for now.